Is leadership a skill that you're born with? Or is it something that we can all develop? To get to the bottom of this, we're gonna go back in time to the very first Jewish leader, Moses. Moses started off as a shepherd for his father-in-law. Now one day he's shepherding, is that a word? Yeah. His sheep, and one of them ran off. <laughs> Moses ran after this little sheep, and God saw this and he said, Moses, because you ran after that sheep, you are going to be the leader of the Jewish people. Why is this such a heroic act? It's his job. Of course he's going to run after the sheep. So to get to the bottom of this, we wanted to go to a sheep farm. Off we went. But this is what happened. Today we're going to talk about leadership. And to talk about leadership, we want to take you to a farm. We're actually raising stuff. I'm going to turn. This episode has been co-sponsored in honor of Mendy and Lior M. Zalak's wedding on the 28th of Tevis. Mazel tov. And Adina and Yaakov Feldfarb. Yaakov has a channel. He says the partial. He doesn't say it. He raps. And subscribe to his channel. And subscribe to our channel. Yeah. It makes us look better. And follow us on Instagram as well while you're at it. Yeah, we want to look good. We got to the farm, and as you can see, car breaks down. Goodbye. So now we're outside the car, and it's getting cold. This couple walks past, and they say, can we help you guys? This guy went all the way to his house to get the cables, and he got his car. Oh. Oh, it's obviously wrong one. Wrong oh, year. Should I put it in drive? <laughs> oh, it's moving. Is it on neutral, Danny? No, it's in drive. But it's not working. Started getting cold. We got the baby, and he's cold and he's not crying. <laughs> Oh, they're being really nice and they're taking us to their house. He said, you guys, it's cold outside. Come to our house. Actually, the hair up to you. Yeah. Look at this shot. <laughs> and then my family. curious about everything now. That is so cute. And your family. And then with mine. But we still needed to film. No problem. I knew you were going to say that. <laughs> I was like thinking of it in my head. Welcome <laughs> to Espresso Parsha. We wanted to teach everyone a lesson about leadership. But in the end, we bumped into people that taught us about leadership. Sophie and her husband just took us into their home. Boom, out of nowhere, they don't even know us. Remember with Moses how God chose him because he ran after this runaway sheep? What was so extra about it? Moses didn't just collect this runaway sheep, bring him back to his flock and that's it. He went after this runaway sheep and he said, hmm, why did he run away? He must be thirsty. And he went and he gave the sheep water. And then he said, hmm, you know what? He must be tired. And he carried the sheep on his back, back to its flock. Instead of looking at the sheep like a rebel, he saw what caused the problem. He addressed the issue. Moses didn't have to go out of his way to see what that sheep needed, but he did. That is leadership. You want me to come and pick you up? Um, that's very nice of you. Okay, thank you, totally. But Moshe, that's very kind of you. Okay. You see, here's another example of leadership. You're on camera, Moshe. Bye, Bye, boy. He's like, what's happening? Bye. Thank Bye. you so much. Really, really guys. appreciate it. Lovely to meet you. Hi, Moshe, thank you. <laughs> I don't know if I would take them or not. <laughs> <laughs> to open up their house to 
complete strangers. We're yeah. strangers. We're like off the street. The human. Oh, let's show them the car came back. Ah. Uh -uh. So now our car is back and it's actually fixed. I just have to soap them because it looks more dramatic. Sophie and Bo walked by our car when it was broken down. They could have just said, figure it out themselves like everyone else does in society. But no, they were in tune. And that attitude is something we can all have. We may need to build it. It's a skill we can all attain.